because they're demonizing masculinity, they're also promoting transgenderism. I mean, oh, you right. see it in the Biden White House and the Biden administration. Every single agency has these executive rules going on promoting gender ideology. So yeah. what are Republicans wanting to do about all of this gender identity stuff going on? What are the plans for the future? And what can regular Americans do about this? Well, let's start with our schools. Number one is we have got to give parents power in schools. We got to give them a, a right, a federal right to see what their kids are being taught, who is teaching them, what their tax money is being spent on, and to make sure that their kids are not given any kind of medication or prescription without their, the parents' authorization. And the way you do that is you give them these rights and then you give the parents the right to sue. So if the school district violates those rights, they can get into court and hold those people accountable. It starts with the schools. Gotta give parents that kind of power. And then we gotta get it out of our military. We've gotta get it out of the federal government, this transgender ideology. Why are we funding this? We shouldn't be in our military or anywhere else. But if we don't take care of it with schools and parents, we'll never stop it. How do you think the history books will look back on this time of the embrace of transgenderism? Oh, I think it'll be, you Especially know, with kids. Yeah, so like a century ago, all of the expert elite liberals were all in favor of sterilizing criminals and forcing sterilization on people. You know, that was their grand idea. And they, they said it was in the name of science. I think we'll look back at this period and say they tried to do it again. They were out there advocating for kids to be sterilized with drugs, to be sterilized with surgeries. They were out there pushing the most radical anti-reality, anti-science, anti-family agenda in American history. And I think they'll be condemned for promoting a form of child abuse. What is the left's interest in separating parents from their children when it comes to transgender ideology? Pa power, I mean, again, it, it, it's, also, it, I, it's also indoctrination, ideological indoctrination. You know, if you get the parents sidelined, then they can fill the kids' heads with the nonsense they want. Um, they can then, again, they can, they can break down those centers of resistance. They don't like the nuclear family. I mean, the left has waged a continuous war on the nuclear family, whether it's jobs for American men to provide for their families, whether it's the parents' right over education, uh, whether it's faith. They have continuously assaulted the family, and this is, I think, the latest frontier of that.